So everybody, welcome to part number 3 of New York Mysteries, The Lantern of Souls, Collector's Edition. This is, of course, for the casual gaming series. Uh, let's see the places. Okay, there, you want me to get inside. Something. Oh, okay, wait, can I... I never thought of this. I'm pretty sure it did this somehow anyway medallion where was a medallion required was it in the next room well medallions and weird keys and shit were required like everywhere but where exactly not this this one no it was a place that required a medallion I don't think you are the one no it's Actually, with like a bird. No, you're not the one. I will identify the shape. It's like I want to look for things a little bit. What else was in there that required, like, further interaction? This? No. This? No. Oh, maybe the shovel? Nah. So yeah, I will have to use a hint. The diary. Oh, the medallion is for the diary. I actually never saw the, the the diary needing a medallion. My bad. July 24, 1959. We had a quarrel with Carrie. The t this time she grabbed an old statuette and smashed it against the wall. I gathered all the shards and hid them so she wouldn't throw them away. Why is she so mean to me? I love it so much after all. Look at this as a hint. Probably with a combination for this little thing. Wait a minute, can I look at something else in the diary? No, it's gone. Well, not very useful then. That's the one, okay. Rotate the arrow to set the correct sequence. Oh, I see. Ah, uh, this is one of those puzzles. This is for resetting. So I need to get this one first. But I have to get it in order. How so? Oh, I got it, okay. One, two, three, four, five. Seven, maybe? <clears throat> okay, I'm getting it. Then three. Then it should be one, two, three, four, five. Then three. Then three. Blitz! Yeah, this puzzle was extremely simple. Alright, a bottle. There's something in the bottle. I can get hold it other than carefully break the bottle okay got it it is just an image of a candle on the note might be telling me to heat it up sheet of paper there we go are these like blueprints well looks like there's a secret cache in the garden I better return and check it indicating this all right so let's go back where was it indicating the tree the palm indicates something is buried in the pot but the soil is too hard to get deal with hands that's why we use the shovel now yeah, sometimes common sense is becomes a little obvious fire symbol I know where to use this thing in the inside, we put the fire symbol 
And we get our first shape lock. Okay, another puzzle. Yay. Find the parts of the pattern in the center. Okay. Little by little. So this... Seems way too simple. Too simple to be true. I know that much. This obviously is part of this. Alright, just these two parts will do. Alright, um, this and the circle. With this level of difficulty for puzzles, I will be able to solve quite a few of them. So I need to get rid of all of these things? Looks like. Well, it's a way of compensating how easy the, the puzzle is by making it a little bit long. What's the one? Oh, this. Then... Triangle and this thing. How many more to go? Three, six. A little hard. <clears throat> Simple enough. I think this is the last one. Got it. Okay, now it comes the last one. This. And then this. Okay, I have to remove all of these ones as well. So yeah, they make it easy but long. Wow, this is a little tricky. Not quite. I mean, what else is in here apart from this one? Yeah, and of course the last two are... Obviously, these two. Erudit. I guess his achievements are for solving certain amount of puzzles. Figuring parts. And... I think you can use glue for this. I'm not even surprised. Yeah, if things were this simple to solve, just by doing this. And this is the hand. I got it. Where was an angel required? Was one of those shapes? This one, right? Yeah, that was an angel. It's no wise to wander through dark corridors in a house where a murder was committed recently. I need to find a lamp or something. What about the flashlight? Yeah, it got a lot when you are start solving things and all of your items are actually worth for something. Damn it! The batteries went out in the flashlight. You know, I knew that was gonna happen. Hey, a generator. Never mind. New place. Oh shit, it's the murder! New task, pulling down the blockage. Alright, so the order asked me to find out who killed Carrie Martell, which is the main task, of course. Have to search Martell's mansion for evidence. Stop the steam building up inside the overheated boiler. So I cannot access because of that, I guess. The metal is too hot, I need some protection for my hand before I grab it. Most likely. I have to go get um, fucking gloves. Oh, collectibles that I accidentally find, of course. Something in the lantern, but I can't reach it. Nah. 
Oh wait, maybe the umbrella? There we go. The lantern door is locked and the handle broken, but if I push something narrow into the slot between the walls, I could hook onto the latch. And that's when the pin comes in handy. Okay, a handle. Too many cobwebs. I need to get rid of them. So yeah, how do I fix this stapler anyway? Oh, with the spring. They mentioned a spring. Another shape. An old figurine button in the floor. I guess I need to find a similarly shaped item. Yeah, pretty much with everything else in this game. Footprints. Okay, it's one of the collectibles. Don't get excited. Don't get a bit dick. Am I done here? Because we can move on to the next area and wrap it up for today. No hidden object sections yet. Which is kind of surprising for now. Anyways, I want to thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you in the next episode of New York Mysteries The Launcher of Souls.